Hi, it's Magnar. In this video, we are on an approach to Port Harcourt in Nigeria. Port Harcourt lies in the southeast part of Nigeria, and this area is called the Niger Delta, and consists mainly of a labyrinth of waterways and mangrove forests, and mosquitoes. This area is also known for being the largest producer of oil in Africa. They also produce a lot of gas. Petroleum accounts for more than 80% of Nigeria's income. This makes Nigeria the largest economy in Africa. But this doesn't mean that the oil is to the benefit of everybody. The unemployment rate in Nigeria is very high. And in 2020, it was reported that 40% of the population was living in poverty. Neither does the government have control over many activities in the Niger Delta. There is a widespread theft of crude oil from pipelines. This oil is refined in makeshift refineries, and most of the products are sold locally. This is a lucrative activity, but it's very dangerous. Just a small mistake and everything explodes. There are also a lot of gas flares from the oil wells and all the oil fires. The result is a thick black smoke that mixes with the humid air and forms smoke. In Port Harcourt, the smoke can reduce the visibility to less than 100 meters. And it is so toxic that you are lucky if you live long enough to see your 50th anniversary. The airport at Port Harcourt is some distance from the city and the oil wells, but the smog is still an issue. We are now established on the ILS approach to runway 21 at Port Harcourt Airport. The dark grey layer you see here is smog. At about 500 feet above minima we can see the runway threshold, but we keep the autopilot on. And that's the VOR. Ahead of us is a dark wall of smog. We will see more of it when we depart. The air is very humid and dew starts to form on the side windows. We put on the side window heat which heats up the forward part of the side windows.
and here comes the GPU. Okay, we are ready for departure. You can see the smog ahead of us. It would have been a benefit to depart from the opposite runway, but because of all the traffic, we had to depart in this direction. The clearance was to climb on runway heading. I was thinking, we are not going to fly into this. If we cannot get over it, we will turn, even without clearance. At this point, we were handed over to the radar controller, and we were cleared a right turn towards the destination, Lagos, just in time. This is smoke from burning crude oil. You might think that it should be easy to shut down this activity, because the sources are very easy to find. But uh, there is too much corruption going on in Nigeria. Okay, that's all for this time. Please support my channel by sharing with your friends and all that. Thank you for watching, have a wonderful day and happy learning!